Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm here um, with a naked face, yep, because I've decided that I'm going to do a bit of like a fun sort of chatty get ready with me because I actually have a reason. Normally I do these videos as just a video and it's easier to do because it sort of kills time because then I can do my makeup on the video. Like that is the video and it's pretty good. But I actually have uh, two videos to do. I have um, a haul, <laughs> a certain haul that I actually need to be ready for. So I thought, you know what, uh, why don't I just do my makeup and we'll chat a bit because I have things I really need to talk to you about, okay? And it was a bit awkward. I didn't really know what kind of video to do in that case. I just wanted to talk about things, but I was just like, uh, so I thought if I do a get ready with me, I can just put my makeup on. You can join me join me if you need to, you know, if you're going somewhere, put this on and just listen to me ramble basically about random shits. Um, of course, I'm going to be talking about some shows, so there will be spoilers, I just have to mention. But um, I'm sure that you will, uh, if you're watching this, then you'll have seen what I'm going to talk about. But I think I'm also going to timestamp it, though. So if you want to skip things that you've not seen and you don't want to be spoiled with, then you could just skip it. But yeah, I'm basically just going to sit and get ready to do this haul that I need to do, <laughs> basically. And I thought I would just film so we can chat. Oh, yes. So let's go. All right, so we're gonna get started. I'm gonna put my uh, handy dandy um, this on. <laughs> it's a bit grubby now, but I'm gonna put it on. I saw a thing actually where apparently you're meant to put these on the other way round, and then this holds your hair. But I don't. This doesn't work. I've tried that, and it doesn't do that. So I, I others that have like metal, like metally bits in, uh, they work. But uh, mine don't do it. I think mine's just pretty. <laughs> so there we go. I'll put it up like that. God, my hair. <laughs> it looks great. Um, but yes, um, so the first thing we're going to talk about is, of course, uh, Heartstopper and the season two, because like, holy shit. I have been wanting to talk about uh, season two and stuff on a video for ages, but I've just been like, I don't know what to do. So I thought, right, I'm going like, to include it in this because why not? Um, and I'm gonna do my eyebrows first, but makeup, it's literally not I like showing you what I'm doing, like every utensil I'm using. I'm literally just doing it. And the main thing is to talk about things. So like, yeah, we'll see how it goes. I'm not really sure, but we'll just, we'll just see. But yes, um, so the first thing we're gonna talk about is season two of Heartstopper. So if you haven't seen it, what are you doing? And go watch it now before I come and find you and be like, why? But yes, um, okay, so I did an, literally an hour and like 30 minute video of talking about it because I had to. Um, and then I think I already knew about season two then, but it was still like, just been renewed and, and stuff but now oh my god i'm actually attacked like all the things i've seen they've like cast the new characters and then they've like been i've seen people leaking and i'm like don't you dare but also uh, i kind of like it because i want to see it but i don't i honestly i'm not ready to see it like it's my obsession and i feel like i can't wait like i'm impatient i already want it to be april because I'm, is it April? Is it next April? Because I think it is. Um, so I already want it to be next year. Like, can we just tell, can we just like <laughs> teleport? But like, can we just like, you know, quickly go into, into the future just to see it and then come back? <laughs> because like, I can't wait for it. I actually can't. I'm honestly so excited. And like all the, like, oh my God, I was attacked when they, um, did that picture she was like alice did the post of the the cast and was like here they all are and i was like how dare you because they re recreated a picture of the comic like a, a drawing she'd done of like all of them and i was like okay i was like i instantly knew that it was that i was like holy shit they've done that bloody uh drawing and I was like, that's really rude <laughs> that they do that to me. They attacked me like that. And like them cuddling. Oh my God, as well. That bloody um, like teaser thing they did. Because um, I already, I've got so much shit on Twitter 
Um, so I, I heard people saying like, they're doing it, it's happening, you know, it started, Heartstopper starts filming today, and I was like, oh my god. Um, but then Netflix like, be attacked me and released this thing of them all, oh my god, them all saying hi actually triggered me on that bloody thing. But like, whoa, them two like with their script like looking at each other and then they said hi together, what the f- <laughs> I actually can't, like it was like whoa, 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 and then all I saw was that, like all the time. I was just like, stop, go away from me because I can't cope. I'm actually sure, I was I was at work that day, they, they, they released it and I was on my break and I was sort of hyperventilating, I was hyperventilating in the bloody team room because I was like, <gasps> don't you dare do that. I couldn't cope with it. So then I had to save it. Like I think it was on my TikTok, it was then on Twitter everywhere, and it was on Instagram. It was literally all over all over the place. But I had to save it and keep all of it because I was like, yep. Um so I was living for it. And then all of the new characters. Because obviously, season two is gonna be all about book three. Okay, so this is where we have spoilers because if you've not like read the book, then you won't know because oh my god i of course have now read everything so i know what's happening so i'm almost like shit do i want season two or do i not like i, I do desperately but also don't because like we know <laughs> if you know then you know because we are going to be pained but i did see a tiktok of someone being like oh my god i can't wait for season two of heart Supper because i need more nick and charlie in my life but then they were like I, how de like if they if they dare uh, break them up because obviously there's some shows out there that bloody and irritate me. I keep saying bloody, but like that irritate me because of the they just like make me pine over or pine, make me completely ship um, two people pining over each other, and then they finally get together and then they break them up. <laughs> High school musical, new school, the series season three, but like <laughs> yes. Uh, <laughs> I hate, we are lucky with that. They were, all the comments of that video were like, huh, relax because like read the books and then you'll be all right. Because obviously they don't and we're happy about that. So that is the only thing that I get so excited about in season two is that I know they're gonna be amazing fucking cute ass boyfriends the whole time and I'm not gonna cope. Uh, but the pain part of it is obviously um the eating disorder thing which i'm like mm -hmm, i i don't want it i actually don't and obviously people have been doing like things i think i've seen tiktoks of like people po posting the, those parts of the comic and saying like i'm not ready to see this and i'm like i know me neither and it's just like not being funny season this season i keep saying season three but like book three isn't as bad as book four. Oh my god like i actually don't know if I'm going to be able to cope with that either, but like that will be, I'm pretty sure, I think that book three is that big that I think that's just going to be season two because there only, there's only eight episodes, so I feel like it's just going to be season, like book, book three for season two, just like, I just think it is because I don't think we've got enough, we're not going to have enough time to do everything because <laughs> they obviously like, there's a bit before they go to Paris, and then they go to Paris and do all that jazz. Do they look, do they look even? <laughs> no, they look a bit weird. <laughs> Hang on. But yes, uh, they obviously go to Paris, and I can't wait for them to do it. I, obviously, I've seen them in Paris, and I was just like, stop attacking me. Like, I want to see it, but I also don't, because like they don't want us to anyway. Like, Alice and the producers have been like, don't leak, because it's not nice. Like, it's not... It's not fair sort of thing um and so i'm the same but i'm also like mm, i kind of want it uh <laughs> so i've seen obviously bits of it and i'm like oh my god i'm not gonna i'm actually not gonna cope and also i'm not even joking but that day that they announced like the date of that i am booking it off work and i am telling everyone like, like my mom do not touch me don't look at me do not don't i am like sitting in my room with all of the like tissues popcorn f snacks and everything and i'm watching it's a heart stopper day like if you've watched my red bubble haul then you'll know that i bought a top and a hoodie and stuff they will be on and uh yes i will be living my best heart stopper life like i actually will um because that day is dedicated 
to Heartstopper, like it actually is, because I'm so excited for it. And of course, um, I'm gonna binge the fuck out of it. But like, that's the problem. I'm like, oh my God, I'm, I can't wait for it. And the minute it comes out, I'm literally gonna devour it and then it'll be done. And I'll be like, shit. So <laughs> like, I've just done it. But like, I don't know if I care because it's gonna be new content and like I still watch it now and still love it but obviously it starts getting a bit repetitive because I've like had enough of it and I've seen it now so like but I feel like I still love it so it's going to be one of them where it's going to be <laughs> I'm like do I watch all of season one then season two or do I just go straight into season two and watch it I'm probably going to because I'm going to be just too excited um and then I'll probably go back again to season one and do like all of it I, feel, <laughs> I don't know I feel like I'm gonna binge season two and cry and scream and then probably sit for an hour and be like oh my god then I'm gonna go back and binge it again and watch it all over again and, and then I'm probably going to go all the way back to season one and watch the entire thing. Because, <laughs> like, yeah. Because, like, I have to. Like, I feel like everyone has said that that day they are not even doing anything and they're going to stay and do it. But I'm like, I don't blame you, me too. Like, I can't wait for them to... Re oh, God. Just wait until the trailer is out. I'm going to scream at that because we're going to see... Oh, I don't even know what the trailer's going to be like, but it's going to attack me because they're probably going to show them being cute in that and I'm going to I'm gonna die. Oh, help. Like, ugh, a heart stuff is so cute and I'm not ready. And of course, we've got season three as well, which is like, whoa, like the minute, the minute season two ends, I'm going to be like, shit, I need season three now. Um, but of course, <laughs> I'll have to wait for another year until that great but um but no it's like because obviously then season three will probably be about season uh book four jesus i always get confused but yeah book four but like oh i'm not being funny but the bit the i love you bit in book four oh my god i actually can't wait to see that so like, i actually can't wait for kit and joe to do that because i think that'll actually kill me like yeah, I, i'll i know I'm, I'm not being funny but by season three, my corpse will be watching it because I'll al I'm already dead from like all the stuff. But <laughs> like, yeah, I mean, somebody said they should end season two like that, but I was like, they can't because like there's still loads that happens before the I Love You part. Like they go to the beach and everything, and they do all that kind of stuff. And I'm like, there's too much, you know, there's way too much stuff. Um, that they do um before that happens so i feel like it's gonna be um season three that we get that which is like oh but uh still we're gonna get so some such cute stuff in season two and i'm not ready for it i actually i'm, I'm i am but i'm not like i want it now but i'm also not ready so it's just, <laughs> it's just yeah um but yeah i think that's all we'll go with with that because otherwise I'm going to just talk about the, the all of that for the whole time I'm doing makeup. Um, but yes, please tell me how much you're excited. If you love Heartstopper as well and you're so excited for season two, please please tell me because I know there's other people out there. But like I honestly cannot wait. And I, you know what? The last thing I will say is the bit I'm so excited about is the fact that the beginning part, like in the comic, there was a bit where um he you know because it kind of carries on from the, the book like from the book two so he's obviously told his mom so then he goes in to find him at school and he like comes up behind him like guess hey oh my god help and then they like kiss by the locker and i'm like oh, i need that what i've said it in my heart of a video but i need them lovey dovey kissy kissy in the school uniform i just do don't at me but I just do. <laughs> Concealer time, and we're gonna now talk about Miraculous. <laughs> okay, my other favourite obsession and show. So, like, yeah, yeah, if you've, like, not into that, then it's probably skip. But, or you can mute and just watch me do all the bits of makeup if you want. But, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, we're gonna talk about Miraculous season five because, like, hold my wig. It's <laughs> like, woo! Okay, I can't cope with this. All right, so I've seen. The first two, is it first two episodes? Yeah, I watched them ages ago when they came out in French, was it or like whatever it was? I had to watch it in with subtitles, but I still watched it. And yeah, and they go, they've gone back 
to bless me with um, thriving Lady Noir. And I'm so happy because it actually irritated me in season four with the Lady Noir. But obviously it ended quite well and it just sort of like carried on from where it ended because then that dick um, was like doing using all of the miraculouses and it was so annoying. Um, so I watched, but then they came out recently in English. So I then watched them again and I was like, stop, because I actually love it. Like I really do. And they were great. So I watched um, both of them. Um, what was it called? Was it Evolution and, yeah, Evolution and multiplication but like what's the fuck do they think they're doing to my internet heart because like <laughs> for fucking four seasons marinette has pined over that boy forever and now he's finally getting feelings for her and she don't give a shit and i'm like what the fuck they are flipping the love square and i'm like how dare you because like I mean, I don't mind that you are then starting to get feelings for Cat Noir, because, like, what we have, but, uh, why? Because, like, he, you can clearly tell that Adrian is now liking her, like, he's falling for her, and it's like, don't you dare, because I want it in my life, it's so cute, um, and she, but, but then I think it is because of what happened, because she got confused and mixed up him with Felix and all whatever, you know, he thought Felix was him, and of course that made everything go tits up, so then she's thinking like, shit, my love for Adrian is ruining everything and I can't love him anymore, and Alia is such a mood in that episode, was it multiplication? Um, she, <laughs> she is literally the entire fandom in that moment because he rang and she was like talking about it and you, and you could just tell like how much he was living for it, you know, he was like, yeah, and she was just like, no, actually, my buddy or something, and she was like, what's the actual <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, me though. Like, now she's saying it. And I'm like, are you actually kidding me? <laughs> and it's ridiculous. Like, I don't know what they're doing. Because I can't cope with it. I mean, I feel like they are going to happen at some point in season five. Because, like, pfft. so some of the fucking teasers, holy shit. My entire Twitter feed was flooded with them kiss those lady rockies and I was like, sorry, but what on earth are you doing to me? Because that is Rose. Like, and what on earth what the fuck were they doing getting married? It's like, okay. I think it was in in his head or her head or something. But like, <laughs> I was like, Zh -zh. I was like, stop that now, because she was like holding his chin and the way he was looking, and then she kissed him. And there was another one in the cinema where they kissed, and then it, they turned white, and they were getting married. She was like throwing the bouquet. I was like, what is happening to me right in this moment? Because I don't know. <laughs> I couldn't cope. I was like, what are they doing? And I tried to look for it, but it was still not out. And I've still not seen it now. But it's just like that. That time, miraculous was actually killing me and i was like what are you doing? what are you doing so i'm not ready for season five stuff because obviously then there was there was teasing some adrianettes and she was like in bed and he was in her room being like i love you or something and she was like i don't love you and i was like what the fuck is happening i actually can't with with the show like i actually can't like it's a kids show and yet here we are season five and, like, the way it is now is, like, holy shit. And yet, there's still... Like, I am literally going to be old and grey by the time they reveal. Like, I actually am. It's going to be, like, season, bleed, 23. And, like, they're finally going to do it. Or they're not going to do it. I don't know. I feel like they're just going to be, like, oh, it's, like, every time they say they're doing it, it's a, a what if. And it's, like, it's, like, we're reversing it again. And it's, like, we forgot that we did that. But, no. Season 5... I obviously haven't really seen it. I only seen the first two episodes and they were like, whoa, because you can instantly already tell that the love square is flipped and it's rude as fuck. <laughs> it's like, how dare you? Oh, I mean, it's not because like, I still live for Lady War and if like we get some Mary Cat, then all right. But it's just the fact that like, you know, bloody Adrian is finally, I mean, he was trying to kiss her at school and she was like, no. And <laughs> Well, the Alia was like, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> I was just like, save me. It's so rude. Like, it actually is. I hate it. But anyways, <laughs> I just couldn't cope. I had to talk about it. Like, the stuff is season five because it was just like, whoa. It actually was. And, 
I just, I mean, like I say, it's not properly out yet. I feel like it was coming out, but then they changed the dates. Like, wasn't it coming out on Disney Channel? Uh, Disney Channel. <laughs> but I, I used to have Disney Channel, and I don't have it. So I'm going to have to wait for it to come out on, like, Disney Plus or something. But, like, <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm actually not going to cope with that either. I feel like I'm going to scream when I watch those things. Because, like, I feel like she was sad, and oh my god as well. Isn't there, isn't that one? Isn't the one that I'm on about when with the like Asianette stuff? Um, it, I'm pretty sure that's the Kwame's Choice one, and they like change um, miraculouses or like the Plug and Tiki have to like choose somebody else. And I was like, how dare you? Like, why would you do that? Um, and then we had like a sneak peek of New Cap Noir. I'm pretty sure it was a girl with like, oh my god, that looks amazing. And I was like, whoa. Um, but like, yeah. I'm like, oh my fucking god as well. We had a teaser about the movie. Holy shit. That, I was like, do not touch me. Because, like, that was like, whoa. Because, uh, I, we've been waiting for that for so long. Because they kept telling us, I'm pretty sure it was meant to come out this year. And now it's been moved to January next year. And it's like, what are you doing? But then, they did a teaser about that. I think it was on Christina's, uh, was it TikTok? It was something, because I've got her on, on uh, thingy, um, tw uh, Twitter as well. Hold on, where's my thing? I'm going to do some blush now. We're not doing too bad there. But yes, I'm cute. Uh, that was like, whoa. So, uh, I actually, I'm actually not ready to get attacked by all these things, like Miraculous and Heartstopper are going to kill me. They actually are. <laughs> um, I'm, it's just... Oh. Alright, so while I do my highlighter now, we're actually going to quickly talk about the Teen Wolf movie. Because, like, oh my god. So, <laughs> if you haven't seen Teen Wolf, then how dare you. But, obviously, I have and seen all of it. And now we've, like, we had told that there's going to be this movie coming out. And we got the trailer, and I think they've released the date. It's actually the day before my birthday, which is, like, in the 26th of January next year. Which is, like, oh, my God. Everyone's, like, next year? How dare you? But, um, I'm not, I'm not okay about that either. It looks so good. And, of course, Alison is back. But, uh, bad. Like, is she void, Alison? Because, like, <laughs> that's going to be, like, whoa. And I can't wait to see it. And believe Derek was a dad. I was, like, holy shit. Because they did, they, again, like, to announce the date they did like a teaser so i was like whoa like what are you doing to me um so <laughs> that was so cute and i couldn't cope with it i was just like oh my god i'm not i'm not ready for this and my obviously bestie caitlin is obsessed with team wolf she was the one who made me watch it so i feel like we need to book that day off <laughs> both of us and we need to watch it together because um isn't it on Paramount Plus? And I feel like if you've got Sky, you can get things through that. So I might try and see if I can get it because I need to watch it. Because I'm terrible for things where I am desperate to see it, but then I can never watch it because I never have the thing. It's like Grey's Anatomy, all right? They've come out with season 19 and I'm still like behind. I'm still like halfway through 17 because that's only just been put on like UK Disney Plus so I still need to watch season 18 and then obviously 19 is now out but I have to oh my god that's another thing but I have to see 19 because the king himself Harry Shum Jr is one of the interns like the new interns and I'm like uh I have to see that because that's the king himself Mag Magnus Bane and we all know how I love him so like and I love Harry because obviously <laughs> if you go back to my old videos you'll know because of like all the shadow hunter stuff i talked about but like yeah so i need to i need to try and work out how to watch that i mean because like it's all on like is it hulu and stuff it's i don't know it's all on things that i can't get or watch because like why at the moment they have to have like 56 different types of platforms to watch on and you have to p pay for them all i think it's a bit offensive not gonna lie because i can't afford all these things like why can't we just have one thing that they play everything on because it's annoying. I have Netflix and Disney Plus, but that's it. We had Prime for a bit, and I did watch, I think I did watch, like, the first um, good few seasons of Grey's on that, because it was on that. And then we got that star, didn't we? And then they added Grey's Anatomy on that, so I started watching it then on Disney Plus. 
Um, eventually, though, they'll add season 18 onto it. But, like, we're already into season 19 now, and I want to watch it. But, uh, I can't, because I can't watch them straight away, so it's a bit rude. But, I'll get there eventually. It's just, yeah, it's just one of them. Uh... But yes, what should we talk about now? <laughs> I did briefly shade um, season three of High School Musical, the musical, the series, because of course I watched that and I was like, what? <laughs> okay, um, I feel like I did talk about it once before, but we'll like briefly go into it. But um, yeah, I I don't know how to feel, okay, about the, how it was. I loved the, the season. I, I'm not being funny, I feel like Ricky was amazing i think i felt like he was one of the best characters during the, this season like he was hilarious and it was brilliant um obviously rena sands were probably screaming and crying and living their best lives because like we finally got it like rena happened but i loved portwell i really did i was honestly season two I was living for them. They were so cute. And the way they pined over each other the whole season was so cute. And then, of course, they, t they robbed us and teased us because they then, like, left us hanging with the kissing. Like, I'm going to kiss you. And then they didn't show it. So I was like, oh, my God. Um, and so then they start season three where they are together and they were a lovey-dovey to begin with. But not much. Like, we hardly got anything because then they made bloody... EJ, I felt like they couldn't decide, hang on, but I felt like they couldn't decide whether they wanted EJ to be good or bad, because like, he was in, he was interesting in season one, then he redeemed himself and he was brilliant in season two, and then yet again he changed again, and he was, li he was bloody living out his Troy Bolton era, I think, because of his hair and what and what was going on with that, but yeah, it was weird, because like, I didn't blame him for being stressed and stuff because of all the like pressure he was under with all the like doing of that and directing and stuff but like i just didn't want it i really wanted to just have cute uh portwell and they robbed me you know and plus gina was just everything in that season like also she was everything i feel like you could tell that the entire season they were like coming like it was gonna be arena season because even ricky like i say was brilliant and he was hilarious all the time and it was just everything you know and so was she like she was slaying every look she wore and her hair looked amazing and the the, the songs she sang and stuff she had so many solos in it and i was like it's about time like she's amazing um so it was hard i liked the season i did but i was offended with what they did with Portwell because I loved them so I was like you could have at least got them together sort of like near the end of two and we could have had a bit of them then and then a bit more in season three if you were going to break them up because like how dare you <laughs> but I will briefly mention um Rena because I'm not being funny that ending was like whoa and um I couldn't cope with the kiss <laughs> I was like holy shit um it was everything like it actually was and uh, i was laughing because obviously corbin blue was in it and he was like being a bit shady i was like what the hell but like the way it ended oh my god him singing every day actually triggered me like it really did but yeah i would i just wanted to talk about the rena bit at the end because obviously we're gonna we're also getting a season four now aren't we so of course we're gonna have like um rena together in season four but like is that it? it's like are we then gonna just you know like be together like don't do that and then be like actually psych just kidding i'm breaking up with you now to get back with is him or like whatever it's like i'll i'll get with somebody else like <laughs> like what are they doing that's the only thing with shows like that is that they can just like completely just scribble out the writing and just be like actually we'll do this instead because like you know it'll stir things up and be even better okay girl look at this eyeshadow it looks great so we're just gonna talk about that for a minute because like come on get it girl that's so good it's um yeah i used two different palettes <laughs> one from in here one from in here and it looks it looks great look at that i love it it's nice and shimmery and gold and we love it so while i now start on my under eye um we're gonna now talk about the sims okay <laughs> so they're all things i love um and of course they are because i just have to talk about them because i'm obsessed with them but at the moment i'm actually living for the sims 4 but there are things that are irritating me but like 
what I want to talk about is the fact that yesterday uh, we had this thing called Behind the Sims, like a Sims Summit thing where they were announcing some new stuff and oh my god, the way I screamed, I think I gave myself tonsillitis after that because like, okay, so for years now I have been saying that I need better babies in this game because if you know if you're a fellow simmer if you play the sims 4 they've neglected babies for way too long they are shit like they actually are i hate them and the fact that they're an object and they're attached to that shitty bassinet it drives me up the wall and without custom content and mods and different things i can't do it i actually can't so i am a mod i am a game like player of mods and custom content so i have to have like the invisible like crib thing and i get my own stuff to make it look better because it looks just shit and i can't cope with it but oh my god the way i screamed when they when they announced it i was like i'm actually not okay um but it's one of them where i feel like now they have honestly the sim gods have answered my prayers and they've heard me because i literally for years i have said that we need a generations pack like we do i want it they need to be, do elders better because i honestly feel like they neglect every other age age stage um or life stage in the sims 4 except young adult and adult like they only care about those two ages in the sims 4 like they actually do every other age i mean now they brought out high school years so teens have got a little bit of like something something now but like they still neglect every other age and it's rude um so now i've all so i've always said i want generations and probably because i'm such a like family based player i always want um you know i just like them to all, always have a family and like do the wedding stuff so not gonna lie having my wedding stories was brilliant i did look i did like that a lot um and i've been enjoying that so and then high school years i haven't actually got it yet but i will be getting it so i do like that but i wanted more honestly what i really want is a birthday stuff pack or a kit or something for like birthday parties because the way i get fed up with the balloons and stuff and the like party things we just have nothing like we have nothing to decorate with and it stresses me out a lot um i hate it and i kind of wish that now because of like they added the whole ability to go and buy a cake for your wedding with in tartos or like with wedding stories i feel like they should do that with birthday cakes so that you don't always have to make them because it's a bit irritating i'm not gonna lie but yes the fact that now um, they have teased, because I honestly think it's going to be a Generations pack, it looks amazing. They teased some, like, worlds, and then they teased some, like, things coming, and all of the pictures, I'm not being funny, are relating, like, clearly relate to um, a Generations pack. Like, they obviously do, because there was a bloody kid on a bike, and then there was a woman with a baby on her back, which I'm like, don't you dare. And then, of course, they teased this, like, little baby thing at the end where it was crawling and it, like, flicked its legs around and sneezed and then lay back. And its mum picked it up. Oh, I actually can't cope with it. It's crazy. I will say, though, it didn't look entirely babyish. Like, is that... I don't know. I feel like that is not a newborn. Because, like, if you go to the hospital and come back with that, then that's kind of massive. Like, that's sort of like a small toddler, I'm not gonna lie. But, um... Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> Let me just smudge my thingy. Um, but I honestly don't care because it looked great. And I can't wait for it. I actually can't. And they were, like, expecting 2023. I was like, don't. Because, like... I want it now <laughs> like I really do I feel like I want all my sims to have a baby just be, just to do that um the only thing though <laughs> my game is with jack talking about babies because I had that invisible crib mod in my game but then it glitched because it like went out of date and I deleted it but for some reason I still have a trace of it in my game and I cannot get it out I actually can't I have no idea where it is i tried i've literally tried everything to get rid of it and it's still there so i'm wondering because i have had serious glitches because obviously i was really frustrated for a while after the high school years patch update like affected everything um 
I couldn't really play it because it ruined my um, lifespan. So now I've had to like turn aging off in my save because it's still, um, it doesn't work anymore in my game for like long lifespan. Oh my god, my nose is running. Hold on. But yeah, the new patch update uh, decided to ruin my lifespan. So now I have to, I had to um, turn off the uh, aging because I don't like my Sims aging up too early. I get a bit frustrated with the aging up and the dying and all that, all that jazz. So the fact that it did glitch a little bit was a bit irritating. So like. I've had a, a few issues, but like all I wanted to talk about was the fact that they were uh, going to update babies finally, and I actually can't cope. Like I'm so excited for it. I feel like it's about time, and we just need it in our lives. Because I'm not gonna lie, that Sim Summit was a bit boring. Like I did skip a little bit of it because I was like, "Where's the exciting part? You know, like where is it?" Because I was expecting something. Um, so I was like that can't be it like please don't tell me that's it i mean they did tease the sims 5 pretty much you know like it pretty much was the sims 5 um what do they call it project renee <laughs> so you know like they did do that and i was like holy shit um that looked amazing i just don't know if i'm ready for it yet though and but the thing is that it's still very much in early development so i'm like i'm not w worried um because a lot of people are saying, like, oh, The Sims 5 is coming, and I'm like, what? <laughs> but it doesn't mean I can't still play The Sims 4. Um, I feel like, though, that reminds me, because, like, hold on. <laughs> when they announced The Sims 4, I was excited and, and bought it. But then I was like, I couldn't really get into it that much. So then I, I still played The Sims 3 for a while, because I, I wasn't keen on it and then it eventually I uh <laughs> hang on I eventually uh came round and started and loved it and I do play the sims 3 now and again I still love the sims 3 but um no I just I've I just love the sims 4 now so it's hard to think that when they do do a sims 5 whether I'll be like instantly like fuck you sims 4 and i'm playing this now or like no I'll, i'm still gonna keep it i actually am because like why wouldn't i like I, I to be honest i'm like i still want more for them sims 4 like we still need more like i say we need a bloody stuff pack or some i don't know if i want a kit i mean you could do a kit but the kits aren't that big i want a stuff pack where it's just decorations like birthday stuff literally and then I need the generations, which I think we are getting, to be honest. So that'll be brilliant. Like, I actually will. And they can update babies before it. And then we can get more in the generations pack. Absolutely. Cannot wait. All right. So that's my finished look. If you want me, if you want, actually, I might link things down in the description that I used in case you want to know what I did considering I didn't actually say I did show some things but obviously I didn't really do any of that it wasn't really like that I was just sort of doing my makeup and chatting but like <laughs> it was probably a bit of a rambly video um but like please do talk to me in the comments about some of these things I've talked about because I just need your input and your like I just need your like what's the word import yeah i just need what your opinions and what you think about these things because i can't wait for them like i feel like they're all just either shows or things i'm excited about you know like the sims and stuff i got any on my teeth no yeah. mm -hmm. um but yes um i just i just need your say because yeah <laughs> i just had to talk about them so like please let me know what you think so yes, I really hope that you enjoyed. Let me know what you think in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to and I will see you in my very next video, which will be my promo call. Bye bye. Then, her, what the fuck are you, <laughs> but like, what the fuck are you doing? And, uh, <laughs> I don't know what to do. But like, all right, so what I'm gonna, so, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> the teen wheel, <laughs> the what? The, what am I doing for the thumbnail? Yeah, oh, don't forget that girl.